We must publish more as people. It's very, very important that we do that. We don't have enough information out here. That's very important, and we need solid information out here. We as a people must read also beyond our African Senate books. Some people get some people are getting caught up in reading black only books or books written only by black authors. I warn you that can limit your perception. We're writing as much as we can. Other people are writing as much as we can, as they can. But frankly speaking, there are the number of African Senate books written by African authors is still very narrow in terms of the kind of knowledge and information we need to have as a people. And consequently then, we must integrate a lot of other knowledge from a lot of other sources into an African-centered program. I am concerned with Africanizing information. You can get information from anywhere and any place and anybody. It's not the source of the information that is of major importance. It is the question that you have in mind and the intentionality that you have in mind when you uh, contact that information that is of importance. When you come with certain African-centered questions and certain African-centered intentions, you can subvert the intentions of other people. And even though they may have written lies, they may have written a book to falsify your image. With an African-centered question in your mind, and an African-centered intentionality in your mind, you can still gain useful information from that. And you can turn then their intentions into something that works for you. So you just can't say, well, because it's written by a white man, I'm not going to read it. Mm -mm. Or because, well, it's lying and they're intended to do it. No, the fact that you know it's a lie is, is information. <laughs> now, why is it a lie? What is the end point of the lie? What is trying to be accomplished there? What is the technique of the lie? How is this hooked into propaganda? In what way is, is this group trying to transform my consciousness? What techniques and methods can I get from this to use against my enemies? What are their methods and techniques of propaganda that I can use to advance the propaganda for African people? Because see, our, our propaganda is not necessarily lies either, you know. And propaganda is not necessarily a negative term. Propaganda comes from the basic word to propagate, to move information, to communicate information, to persuade. And the methods of moving information and communicating information and of persuading people is not a science of Europeans only, not by any stretch of the imagination. As a matter of fact, when you study the oral tradition, you'll find that that tradition is very much grounded in persuasion.